and you're standing on its scar. Imagine for a second that you're not just a sleepy podcast listener tucked in with a fan blowing at your ankles. Imagine you're a French geochemist in 1972 dressed in safari khakis and regretting your life choices as you swat at your 50th mosquito of the hour. You're here to solve a mystery why this uranium is missing its punch. But what you find is something deeper. The Oklo mine itself doesn't look like much. Just a rocky pit framed by trees and mud. No glowing green ooze. No temple to a forgotten god of radiation. If this were a movie, you'd already be rolling your eyes. But reality reality's always quieter. And creepier. Samples are pulled from what geologists call reaction zones. At first they only find one, then another. And another. In total, 17 separate zones, all showing signs that uranium-235 had once undergone sustained fission. Let's pause there. That's 17 places where the Earth decided to run a nuclear experiment while the rest of the planet was still figuring out photosynthesis.